Welcome back to Pumpkin Maintenance. Today I've got some fridge handles that are the wrong way. I'm going to be showing you reversing these. A lot of, uh, well, the most often thing that people miss is forgetting to change these brackets from the bottom side, from the right side to the left side. Or vice this versa. This kind of prevents the door from opening too far. It allows it to stop at a particular spot. And it's kind of, that's, that's what I see the most people miss. A lot of times you'll need some hex heads or allen keys. Sometimes you'll need a star key. Um, this one, it's just, I'll need an allen key. And yeah, get the drill will definitely speed things up here. Um, you've got a lot of set screws that are, that are here to be changed. The opposite side. So we'll be rotating these out here. No big deal. And the other side. Here's these different decals and stuff that are actually covering the uh, little insert spots for the screws. Good idea to use something like a plastic store card in between here to prevent scratching when you remove these little inserts that are like little placeholders. Although this area will be covered by the handle, but you never know if you want to change it back the other way again in the future. So better to just prevent scratches. Yep, yep, yep. Okay. Now our door will come off. Change the handles first, kind of almost makes more sense. Uh, this one needs the Allen key for the top portion. Just have to be careful not to scratch it. I don't want to lose the set screw. Here's the set screw. So now, as I'm telling you, the, uh, the most often thing that gets missed is this plate right here. A lot of times people forget to trade it to the other side. Here it's best to put this on something soft such as carpeting or if you put a towel uh, over the counter. So, you know, first do no harm. Don't want to scratch anything else or, or uh, break anything else when doing something like this. I can trade it to the side, and while I'm here, I can pull off these little bits of packing wrap that didn't get didn't get taken off. This is the most often thing that people forget right here, including myself. All right, uh, the freezer door is ready. Except for the handle. I'm 
little bit easier to get in here. Nothing in the way. Nice design on these handles, yeah, nothing really to different type of fridge that the handles are always breaking. <laughs> this one I have yet to have any handles break so it's a nice system. Okay this deal it uh, untwists here and it's got a screw port in the top here. Sometimes you gotta pre-loosen it a little bit but anyway we're gonna flip that one over. And that's going to go on the right side instead. Um, before I do that, I want to trade my handle. So, there we go. This one actually has a screw in the top portion here. Well, we don't need to remove that screw. And this one, we'll want to be real careful with our Allen key so that we don't scratch the fridge. little plug fell out from here but it just goes it'll go in the opposite end on this side so that's nice and, easy. and this deal will flip over that's nice and easy as well so, need a little more Bottom one. This one, we don't have to take all the way out. We can just, just loosen it. This one. This one. This thing will come out, <laughs> and this side will just loosen it. You don't need to 
need to take it all the way out because we slip the wheel off and over. And this one is being pretty stubborn, so I'm going to try to get it by hand. There. There's always one. And now we can just lift it up. And out. Like so. And then we'll just tighten those. Well, I need one of them for this side. Always one stubborn. Stubborn deal, that's the way it is. Okay. And on this side, I'm gonna set this one. So that's the one that's giving me trouble, and I'm gonna take this one. Post is going to be right here, so I'll pick it right here instead. All right, and now we've got our door post here. We go. It's got a little spacer on there. Perfect. Now we're ready for our fridge, fridge door. And don't forget to move the stopper like I did here. The same thing I was telling you about the freezer. Same thing for the fridge door. It's got that little part that needs to move over. Where I get that? So. Got a, this plug here. And this will get rotated to the other side. get the job done. Okay, now we've got our bridge handle. You just see inserts in right there. And the two top screws up top. swing. That's good. And got the little plug up in there. And now our freezer door. Oh no. See, and I did what I told you guys. The thing that always gets forgotten is the bottom. Uh, so I gotta take this one back off and uh, I'll show you here. Fortunately, I'm not too far. It won't be so bad. But what we've got is on the bottom of the door. This deal. And The door will open too far if you don't grab that deal. So you need to move this to the bottom instead. Not too bad. 
that'll make it right. There we go. Okay, now we've got that on. We can reset our door. Reset the flag. Tighten that up just a little bit. Now we're ready for the freezer door. one where I messed up and kicked myself but uh, this is the life lesson learned be careful with the allen key when you're pulling the allen screws out um, in that when I was loosening that one up I caught that with the allen key something to uh, improve on and watch out for in the future life lesson learned all right <laughs> Well, hopefully I can learn this stuff for you guys, then you don't have to make the same mistake. Because, uh, unfortunately, mistakes do happen. And, well, we can learn from our own mistakes, we can learn from other people's mistakes, too. So, I figure I'll share mine with you. And then you don't have to make the same mistake Good. that I did. Alright. Here's the first screw. And then I've got to locate the second screw, which I can't see very well. In fact, I can't see it all. Find it. Looks like I may have my in the wrong spot. Looks like it needs to be here and here. That's what it is. In. just a little little cleanup and uh, th these uh, set screws can go down in here as well so we don't need them in the future just finishes everything off nice and neat okay. now again just a little cleanup and there's the Life lesson learned there. Watch out. The Allen key. But uh, a little stainless polish. And uh, you know, no one will probably notice that little spot, but it is what it is. You're good to go. Fridge handles nice and reversed. Good to go. Thanks for watching. Kung Fu Maintenance. Over and out. Yeah, it's a little more functional to the particular fridge setup. A little stainless steel polish. I'll make it like new. Oh wait, it is new. All right, thanks for watching. If you find these videos helpful, a one-time donation would be greatly appreciated. Also, if you uh, support me on Patreon, it helps me do what I do. 
there are some special perks for Patreon supporters. And uh, we'll see you on the next one. Just a test, it's a test.